This feels so good. I just fired him. Do you not want to come too close? Hello. What? A beautiful autumn day. And it looks even more beautiful on this stately college campus, doesn't it? The majesty. It's day 19, we're at Miami University in Ohio. I have my first show tonight in like four days. I can't wait, I need it. I need a hit of that sweet, sweet comedy juice. But first, we're gonna go say hello to the hockey team, I think. But I was trying to get on the ice, but they said there was a liability thing, like they were oh, scared really? that I would hurt all your players or yeah, something. Yeah, that's not good, we don't want that. <laughs> we don't wanna do that. I haven't gotten on the ice in a few years, like three really? years, so even just being out there and like smelling it and feeling the cold, I was like, oh man, I remembered all those mornings drinking Timmy's coffee. Well, we have a Timmy's here now. You got a Timmy's? It just opened. Hey, it opened this morning. Yeah. Tim Hortons, Canadian institution, if you don't know it. You gotta take them. This is what I told you about. Wow, this Come is on. beautiful. Oh yeah, the smell of sweaty men, I miss step it. Step on that. Don't step on it. <laughs> Sorry guys, close call. All right guys, I want to introduce you. Come on up. A buddy of mine from Toronto. Uh, What's some up guys? Of you guys have seen him before. He's a comedian, DJ Demers. You got it. He's on campus here this uh, tonight, so so welcome. He's just gonna sit on our meeting. And you guys can introduce yourself after me. Hey Grant, were you on America's Got Talent? I was, I yeah. Familiar. Hey, Alex Alger. how you doing, man? Doing nice well. to meet you. Nice good, to meet you. good. This feels so good. You have no idea, this was my whole childhood. Huh. For me, for real? It's incredible. I wouldn't wear it at Wisconsin though. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow. We've been walking for the last 20 minutes. There's a Tim Hortons on campus, so we had to go to it. I didn't realize it would, it would be this long of a walk. I hope it lives up to the hype. You ready for this? Yeah. Ready. You're gonna love it. Large double-double coming right up. Time to sweat, baby. I'll get a medium regular, please. Um, extra Canadian. That doesn't mean anything, does it? I don't know. And um, I'll get uh, 20 Timbits. I'll just get an assortment, please. Even the ones that don't have any frosting on them. I don't discriminate. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's like pornographic almost. Look at those Timbits. <laughs> In my younger years where I didn't understand how important diversity is, I used to say none of the plain ones. And now I recognize that these have value too. Timbits have taught me a lot about life. I said I liked the plain Timbits, but they gave me too many here. Just want to let them know I'm too much of a, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't like confrontation, so I'm not going to tell them personally. But I'll just say for any franchises opening up new Tim Hortons, if you're trying to give people random Timbits, don't give that many plain ones. I can tolerate a little bit, but that's too many plain Timbits. Just a word of advice. I just got a brand new pair of white shoes and it's about time. The last ones I outgrew. I told my mom I would keep clean. And I don't make promises I don't mean. Yeah. If I let somebody scuff him, I love him I told my dad I'd get him, but let somebody scuff him I love him, I told my dad I'd get him, but I got my laces tied I'm two-stepping with my best foot forward yeah. I'm playing Mariah Carey because she's one of the greatest divas who ever lived And I got my diva on I brought my own Himalayan salt lamp into the green room Let's get rid of Mariah here for a sec Sorry, Mariah, I love you, always. But I don't think you're a diva if you brought your own Himalayan salt lamp I didn't tell them, you gotta have a lamp for me Brought this bad boy in from the RV you feel the energy difference? I do. You know what I feel real good about? Wearing my brand new, brand new uh, Miami jersey, courtesy of Coach Blasi. It's showtime, baby. Woo! <laughs> hey, thank you. Keep it going. You guys feeling good? Yeah. You feeling good? No, 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 no. I'll be right back. You guys feeling good? Yeah. Woo! Oh my God, I feel amazing. Look at this. Coach Blasey on your men's hockey team gave me a free jersey. Can you believe that? Keep it going for Coach Blasey, man. That guy's the best. You took your shoes off? You're barefoot up in this mother right now? 
<laughs> That's supreme comfort. I don't know why. I don't mind feet. They're like nicely manicured though. I don't want to get too weird here, but you got some nice feet there. I'd never wear shoes if I had feet like that, man. Yeah, get this. Put this in the vlog, Justin. Me complimenting this man's feet. <laughs> That's all we're gonna... What's your name? Jack. Jack? Jack's got lovely feet, everybody. <laughs> Check the vlog tomorrow, Jack. The world's gonna know. I was initially mad about the whole idea of you exposing them. I've come around now. In fact, I can't think or talk about anything else at this point in time. Oh, you took your watch off too? What the f is going on here, Jack? She's leaving. She didn't like the feet talk. Jack, come on, man. That's on you, dude. Thank you very much, guys. You guys have been so amazing. Thanks for having me. I often think if I could get hearing back, would I? And I think the answer I'm supposed to say is no. But I think I feel f yeah, I'd love to hear. I just want to, like, I'm so happy when I have my hearing aids in when I hear that I'm like, imagine if this was all the time and I could hear even better. So that's my honest answer. But knowing that you can't change things in life, I do fully accept what it is and I do embrace, like, I do love taking them out when I'm home alone. I'll just go hours without hearing. And I do like that I'm able to do that. So I think I'd want hearing if I could have it, but I don't think about that ever. I don't dwell on it. I'm just like, cool, this is what I have, and I make the best of it. Is there a most inconvenient time your hearing battery has died? Oh, man. Because my hearing batteries die at the most like, awful it's time. It's the worst. I, have to, I never carry them with me. And Mine died on a cruise ship I was performing on, and I didn't have any extra batteries, and nobody had any, and I was deaf no until the show that night. And you know what I did, though? There were so many senior citizens in the audience. I said, does anybody have the 675 battery? <laughs> Somebody's like, I got it, and a cruise ship patron gave me a battery. That is really smart. I'm going to yeah. have to keep that in mind. Yeah, just go on cruise ships. You'll be fine. They always die, and I just never... Yeah, I always, I don't leave the house without one. You I don't know, know how I, I went think, on a cruise think without it. I would it. know after 15 years. <laughs> yeah, but it's just, yeah, I know <laughs> it happens. Happen. You, you don't wear hearing aids, I do, do, yeah. I have them in both ears. Oh, Phonak, cool. actually. Phonak, yeah. represent. Nice. Do you but, hear that? <laughs> <laughs> okay. You will lick your face. Oh my god, I welcome it. <laughs> oh. I just met you. I know this is crazy, but I love you. I have a unilateral loss. So, oh, okay. like, this year, nothing. This year's fine. Okay. And so, I'll hear something and I can't locate the sound. So, I'll hear, I'm like, so worse. Yeah. yeah, you're like trying to find some sort of visual cue. Yes. You're like, what it's happened just here? Call my name. I'm like, I know, I yeah, yeah. Say it one more time. Right. Who said that? Marco. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I just loved your jokes. I, I liked it. You know, it was something I could relate to. Awesome. I'm happy. Yeah. Cool. I'm really sorry. What was your name again? Hannah. Hannah. Yes. Cool. Yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much for coming out <laughs> today. What a show. Got to play hockey today, got to eat Tim Hortons. The whole hockey team signed this hat for me. Thanks to Coach Blasey from Woodbridge, Ontario, Canada. Thanks to everybody at Miami University. Uh, what a great show, a great day. That's the end of day 19. If these trends continue, uh, this week's gonna be a fantastic week. Okay, see you tomorrow, everyone. Thanks, Miami U, you guys were amazing. Can't say it enough, so much fun. Peace. Hey, did you like what you just saw? You should subscribe then. Or you can watch the previous video right down there or a random video right down here. Thank you very much.